hey 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 welcome back to my channel today i'm bringing to you some sweet and delicious buttered cookies these are great for tea time without wasting time let's just get started now i'll get a bowl and come in with about 100 grams of sugar if you have icing sugar you can use it but if you don't have you can use the regular white sugar next i'll drop in 150 grams of butter with the help of my mixer, I'll mix everything up. I'll drop in some vanilla essence and continue mixing. So as you can see, it's very fluffy now. Next, I'll come in with about two tablespoons full of powdered milk. This will add some extra flavor and taste to it. I'll give it a very good mix. Now I'll come in with my cake flour, I'll be using 300 grams. I'll put it in a little bit at a time. Finally, I'll come in with a teaspoon of baking soda. This will make it more crispy. Now I'll come in with my hands and knead it for about two more minutes. Now I'll take a piece of the dough and come in with some chocolate chips. I'll mix it to distribute it evenly. Now I'll cover the dough up and leave it in the fridge for about two hours. After two hours, I'll get it out and with the help of my rolling pin, I'll just roll it up. Now how thick or thin you want it depends on you. I have rolled mine to about half a centimeter. I've got here some biscuit cutters in different shapes. I've got the heart, I've got the Christmas tree, I've got the dove and the star. I'll just go ahead and cut up the cookies. So I cut them all up and I put them in my baking pan lined with a baking paper. Now I have my oven preheated to about 170 degrees celsius i will bake this for about 15 to 20 minutes you have to be very careful because if you leave it for long it's going to burn this burns so easily so you have to eyeball it so it's been after about 15 minutes and this is what we have here our cookies are ready i'll just leave it to cool down and i must say don't be fooled when you take it out of the oven it feels very soft like a cake there is nothing wrong with it it hardens as it cools down so just leave it alone to cool down and it will harden up and i must say as it bakes it expands a little bit so you must give it enough room to expand my delicious buttered cookies are ready i tell you you can't stop at one this will come in handy during the festive seasons kids are going to love this you definitely need this on your breakfast table a cup of coffee with some full cream milk is all you need so as you can see it was so easy and fast to make at least you can start making some cookies at home okay guys so i hope i did help you and i hope you are going to give this a try if you do let me know how it comes out for you if you've not subscribed please don't forget to hit the subscribe button don't forget to share this with family and friends and don't forget to leave me that big fat thumbs up until next time i am going to see you again with another nice and interesting one bye bye